Vicky here, welcome back, and yet again, I'm late, I know, I'm so sorry, I'm so bad at this, aren't I? But I've had a full day of Christmas shopping today, and I got back from town, ready to start filming. I thought I'd just make myself a quick cup of tea, because Christmas shopping was exhausting, flicked the TV on, and Elf had just started, so I'm sure you can forgive me for not being able to pull myself away from that movie until it had completely run its course and finished, so hence why I'm late again today, I know, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But today is a good day because I have picked a winner for my giveaway. So everybody that entered got allocated a random number and then everyone who got extra, entry, extra entries through Instagram got another number allocated to them as well and then I used a random number generator to pick one winner. So I will be announcing that winner at the end of this video but you will notice that I'm not wearing any ears today and that is because I have got some mystery ears to open up. I am so excited about these but the way that this video will work is that I'll do the advent calendars first then we'll do the mystery ears opening and then we'll do the winner announcement at the end of the video. So let's get started with the advent calendars first. Here we go marshmallows. Gosh I can never remember what day it is. There we go, 16. I just have to look for the last one that was open, that's the way I remember. Okay, mint chocolate chip. I'm gonna save this for later with a cup of tea when I'm snuggled up on the sofa, I think. Or maybe I'll even let my boyfriend have one. We are 16 down and I've eaten every single one so far. Maybe I'll let him have that one. Um, but I want to get into these pin advent calendars. I'm loving these bauble advent calendars. Um, when I first saw them on the internet, I wasn't too sure about the design but um they, they just they are really really cute so i'm happy with these and i want to see who's next today so number 16 oh okay oh let's yes i was trying to get the pin back out at the same time by pulling out this black piece of, of foam out of the inside of the box so i've managed to get my pin back out as well and this time we have got Pascal so he doesn't look Christmassy at all so each of these pins has the same background with a character in front of it usually with a Christmas hat or a scarf or something Pascal's just Pascal um he doesn't look Christmassy at all really so that's a bit disappointing but I love Tangled one of my favorite Disney movies so happy to have Pascal and there we have Pascal the sassiest chameleon you will ever meet and time for another Zum Zum. So here is my Zum Zum advent calendar. I'm loving this advent calendar, but you might notice that the top half of my tree is much busier than the bottom half, and there's good reason for that. My puppy keeps stealing those um, those Zums. She's got particular favourites, but I am annoyed because I've just found her literally five minutes ago with Daisy in her mouth. Daisy is one of the best ones that we've pulled from this advent calendar so far, so not happy. I'm going to have to set up my camera, I think, and film her and see if I can catch her in the act. Anyway, let's see who we've got today. I am desperate to start pulling some Robin Hood characters from this. I don't... I've seen spoilers online today, so I know whose today is and it is Stitch. Let's pull him out. Oh my gosh. He's <laughs> so cute. Oh he's winking. He's winking at us. This is so cute. So we've got Stitch in a Yeti outfit and he's so soft. And look he's cuting. How he's cuting? He's winking. How cute. <laughs> look at that. And look at this guy on top. That is so adorable. I love this. And this is so, so fluffy. Great one. Right, where's Angel? Let's put him with Angel. Oh, they've even got matching outfits. I'll show you Angel as well, if you missed Angel's. I can't remember how, when we got that, but look, they're matching. How adorable. Love this. Right. Put them high up so that the doggy cannot get them. There we go. Okay. Magical Pin Box UK time. I'm so excited. If you missed yesterday's video, make sure you check that out. It's in with my um, Tokyo Kawaii pins, but I got a great pin yesterday. It was a limited edition one, which I was not expecting to get 
because I'm pretty sure they're all supposed to be open release or um, like booster packs and things um, until Christmas Day. So that was a surprise and very happy to have got that. So um, they will do, it will be hard to top yesterday, let's just say that, but I'm excited to see what we have got in day number 16. We've got a green and white stripe bag today. Right then, here we go. So it's on one of their own backing cards. Oh, we're having a stitch day. So we've got stitch again. So this is cool. I don't collect stitch, but this is a really, really nice pin and stitch always makes great traders. So although I may not hang on to this one, oh, I don't know, it's so cool though. I love the bright orange on this. So here is the pin. It's a really good size. It's just an orange background with stitch flying through the air and says stitch underneath him. Here he is off the backing card. And on the back, we've got the Mickey waffle and this is from 2012. So I think that's a really, really nice pin. Very happy with that one. And that is all our advent calendars done. My boyfriend just walked into the office um, just before I started filming and he was like, there are pins everywhere. I was like, yes, there are pins everywhere, but um, it's Vlogmas, so what do you expect? Um, so yeah, there's a bit of a mess in here. There literally are pins everywhere. I need to sort them out and get them all, all my, um, all these bauble ones. I need to get them up on my cardboard tree that came with the advent calendar so I can show you that. Um, I know I've said that before, but I, I must get around to doing that. Now it is time for the mystery is. So into my Christmas stocking and I have got two. I know I've said before I don't really buy things in twos, but it was a bit too expensive to buy three of these and I couldn't just buy one. So I have got two of these um, minis ears, which are from Claire's Accessories. Now my friend Tony opened these up on her channel, um, I think it was sometime last month, and I was so shocked that these even existed. Mystery ears mystery is and they're available in the UK as well when I saw them and she said that they were from Claire's accessories I didn't I had never expected that um, these would be available in the UK as well so I was wandering in town doing some Christmas shopping and one of my ears my ears one of my earrings has broken so I went into Claire's to try and pick one up they did have these Claire's accessories mini ears so I could not I could not not buy them I had to have some of these these are so cool and yeah 10 pounds each so not not cheap, but not expensive when you think about how much you pay for is from um, official Disney parks or the Disney website. Um, but these are official Disney ears. It says Disney right on the front there. Minnie Mouse mystery ears. And there are five to collect. So these are the five options that we have. We have four which are pictured on the back and then one is a mystery as well. So double mystery, double mystery, double mystery ears quadruple mystery I think I'm I'm just hoping I don't get any doubles really I would be happy with any of them they feel um they feel quite good quality through the packaging but we shall see so let's get some ears open so that I can get some on my head so the first ones are oh so it's got like a little folded bit that I can open here oh no I say that but no, I can't get in. I might need some. Oh, it's got a tear bit. It's got a tear bit. Here we go. I get, I get doubles. I am. I have such a doubles curse. Oh, these are cute. And I think, I think we've got the mystery ones. I'm pretty sure the. Well, these are not pictured on the back. So I don't. Did I show you them close up? We have this green sparkly pair. A polka dot pair with a pink bow. We've got a multicolored pair with a red bow and then this like blue um, metallic colored one as well but we've got some pink ones so these look a little similar to my rose gold ones i bought recently which is a bit of a bummer i would love to get some that are completely different but 
saying that the bow is different on these. They look quite small. I'm not sure how comfortable they're going to be. But we have got this pair. So they are um, like a pink metallic rhinestone coloured ear with a gold satin bow, but then a silver bow with rhinestones all over it as well. Let's just try and sort this bow out a little bit so it's not so squished. They're cute. Let's get these on. There we go. What do you think? Not bad for a tenor, I'd say. They're actually pretty comfortable. Well, they're a bit hard. I'm not sure how long I'd be able to keep them on my head for, but um, for a tenor, pretty good, I think. Right, I am intrigued to see which other one I get because if I was to pick one, I think I'd really like the multicolored ones. I think they look really Christmassy. So they would be the ones that I would be hoping for. Okay, so I've got rid of those ones. Um, slightly disappointed in how similar they are to my rose gold ones that I recently bought. So I want to get these ones on my head, praying that this is not a double, but knowing my double's curse, they probably are. I even tried to have a bit of a feel, but they all kind of felt the same. So maybe they are all, maybe they were all the same. Oh no, I feel really nervous. You know, when you like, you don't want to open, because you don't want to find out, but you, you have to. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Not a double. Which one of these? Which one of these? Oh. These must be the blue ones. Because they're definitely not the mystery, unless there's more than one mystery. Oh. I just found this inside. Well, sorry, you did not have a winning ticket. Oh yeah, I remember when Tony opened these up. She had these inside and was hoping to win something. I can't remember what you win. Was it, um... Was it a trip? I cannot remember what this was now. Hmm, does it say on here? It doesn't say on the packaging what you could win anyway i got distracted i'm sorry but i didn't win so but i have got these gorgeous purple ears i am loving these ones definitely my favorite out of the two very happy to have these they're not like any ears that i have but they kind of go with my um Ursula mermaid kind of theme of ears that I, te that I seem to have collected somehow. So let's get these on. Wow. These are great. These are actually more comfortable. They don't feel as hard as the other ones. Um, they feel a little bit looser on my head. So yeah, very, very happy with these. Let me give you a closer peek. So here they are. A gorgeous shiny, it's like blues and golds and greens and purples on both sides the back of the ears are just the same and then it's got this purple satin bow which is a bit um almost like iridescent these are great i'm loving these very very happy with these 10 pounds right let's get these ones on we'll have these on for the rest of the video i think yeah very happy with these Okay, time for the giveaway winner announcement. So first of all, I would like to just say thank you to everybody that entered. I've had so much fun reading through all of your Christmas traditions that you've talked to me about. Um, particularly, a lot of people seem to be going down the pajama theme, which um, which I love. I've, I think maybe I need to start that one because I've bought myself, I think, four sets of pajamas already in preparation for Christmas morning. I think I'm gonna to have to change, open a few presents, change into a different pair and do like a, um, a pajama swap throughout the morning to get through all my pajamas. My favorite pair at the minute are um, like sprout ones. It says sprout pout. I love those ones. They're, I've got the bottoms on for those at the minute. Um, but yeah, there were loads of great traditions. The winner, so their tradition was, um, sitting with the entire family taking it in turns to open presents um and they said that that taught them patience and 
Now they really take in every moment when opening presents with their family and I agree, I definitely want for taking it in turns opening presents. I just love seeing everybody's excitement and, and I want to watch people open up my gifts so rather than everybody just tearing their presents open all at the same time, um, yeah I'm definitely one for taking it in turns going round. Um, but yeah, I, I definitely am with you on that one. So the name of the person that won is, oh, let me see if I'm going to get this right. Now, since I pulled this name <laughs> in the random number generator thing, I've since been practicing how to say your surname. So I'm sorry, because I just know I'm going to screw it up. So I apologize now. Skyler is queer do. Did I say that right? I hope so. I hope I didn't completely destroy your name, but you are the winner of the giveaway, so congratulations. I noticed that you um, have followed me on Instagram also, so I'll try to contact you through Instagram, um, but if you see this video, um, make sure you get in touch with me so that I can get your details, get those goodies sent out to you as soon as possible, because I would love for you to have them in time for Christmas. And thanks again to everybody that entered. I'm sorry there could only be one winner. Um, but I will be doing more giveaways come January, so make sure you keep tuned in for those. Maybe hit that notification bell so that you don't miss any of my giveaways. And yeah, congratulations again to Skylar. Thank you so much for entering. I hope you enjoy your goodies. I hope they bring some Disney Christmas magic to you. That's all I've got time for today, and I will see you again tomorrow. I have got a really awesome video coming up for you tomorrow. I've been lucky enough to be able to partake in a Disney um, YouTube gift exchange, a, San a secret Santa gift exchange. So that will be coming to you tomorrow. I'm so, so, so excited to share that with you. Um, yeah, so make sure you tune in for that. That will be 3 p.m. UK time tomorrow or 10 a.m. Walt Disney World time. So hit that notification bell. You are gonna watch, wanna watch everybody's videos. I'm so, so, so excited. So I'll see you again tomorrow. Have a good day, guys. Bye.